<clears throat> oh, hello there. With the coming of this snow season, there's a lot of snow and cold weather, but there are also some other safety measures that should be taken. I'm Officer Lash LaRue, and I'm here to talk to you about snow babies. Now I know that the winter holiday season is a very fun time to let your children play in the fields and backyards and cesspools. But you cannot let your children run around like wild hooligans. <clears throat> snow babies are very, very dangerous. They will kill you and your children. Although you may feel threatened by this snow baby attacks, do not, under any circumstances, try to restrain a snow baby. They can in no way be domesticated or trained. They must not be attacked. You must contact a trained professional such as myself first. As you can see, I'm fully equipped with snow baby hunting materials and equipment. Materials and equipment. This gun is a snow baby slayer 5,000 millimeter. It is very capable of taking out even the largest of snow babies. This here is an example of a snow baby. As you can see, there are small tufts of hair attached at the sides. It has been slain in the proper technique from the top. <clears throat> Many times, snow babies can be misidentified as elks, jars of peanut butter, or human babies. Here we have some of the common weapons that trained professionals use. There are many different strategies used and many different weapons for each of the strategies. This is one of the least common of the different baby hunting weapons. The baby, <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> the snow baby shotgun. I think I got one. Here we have the Indian tribe tog throwing tomahawk. <clears throat> These are very, very rare. We got this by bartering with the targ tog Indians for 10,000 chickens. This is a very different technique that is not used much today. I think I got one. Alright, so here we have the uh, Snow Baby Sniper Rifle. It's a very uh, powerful weapon. <clears throat> it can be used to uh, snipe Snow Babies from distances of up to 20 billion miles. It's my weapon of choice. I think I got another. Uh, here we've got the most rare of the snow baby weapons. This is Excalibur. It was pulled from the stone by King Arthur. There's only one. And when you use this, you must go with a downward motion. Huh. I believe I got another. And last but certainly not least, we have the um, Spyro Baby Tracker. This is one of the more recent breakthroughs in baby tracking technology. It follows their heat signature. As you can see, it has a full function keypad of two buttons, a power switch, instructions in Spanish and English, and sleek styling. Here we have some of the rarest, only footage known to mankind of a snow baby. The people were never found, only the footage. I saw, I saw that there snow baby over there near that stump where I saw that Bigfoot, the alien pods, those UFOs dropping off right down there. Oh, look, there it is, there it is right now. We gotta get out of here. That ain't a deadly baby. That's a deadly baby. Now that you've been fully informed on the dangers and safety precautions that you can take against snow babies, I would like you to all be careful this season since we've not started the deslipification process on the roads yet. <clears throat> Remember, under no circumstances, try to ascertain possession of a baby. Again, I'm Lash LaRue. Be safe. <laughs>